And our final last, uh, last uh, program point tonight is uh, a short late night special by Yoshiro Kawaguchi. I'm very proud that uh, he came here from Japan and I want to ask you to come on stage here and um, give your performance. Hello, good evening. Uh, uh, Yoichiro Kawaguchi from Tokyo. <laughs> uh, and, and okay, shortly, uh, uh, I met uh, Herbert Franke at, at uh, Seagraph 84 in San Francisco, so maybe 40 years, 40 years ago. So then after that, I had a chance to talk with him on the stage at uh, Arce Tonica in Linz. So, uh, today my talking is uh, in, about intelligence of life. So, but anyway, uh, when I started computer graphics in uh, 1975, almost uh, 50 years ago, <laughs> I started uh, computer graphics. And uh, I used a uh, Fortran language with punch card, uh, very old style. So, can I, uh, it is 75, I did programming by myself, everyday programming, programming, <laughs> programming, with a punch card. Please. This is an interactive forum. <laughs> uh, she danced and she, she's controlling uh, rotation speed and, and angle. And also, so this plumbing forum is uh, easily uh, can react, uh, react to her for her uh, dancing. And next, please. And in 1976, uh, I used Rotoka uh, Volterra uh, biomathematical uh, equation uh, formula. So uh, each uh, object uh, are growing, but a strong, strong one is more bigger, and the weak one was uh, died. So I asked uh, for art object has to be arrived by themselves. Uh, it's, I, I, I think our future art should be like uh, living things, I hoped. So this is a completely controlled by the uh, strong one and the weak one. They can do it by themselves. And also, uh, I'm, my interest, so strong interest was a spiral. spiral. Uh, so in uh, 1976, I made a growth cell. So this, this can be, uh, uh, when I, uh, I could make many, many lot of different seashells. Okay, please try. Uh, this is a 3D seashell. At this time, uh, at, at the computer room, uh, many researchers are using a computer, uh, this computer. So this, this is a time sharing we are doing. We made this one, this is a time sharing. <laughs> so this speed is uh, controlled by how many people are using a computer. So sometimes we destroy. <laughs>
after that, I did many, many more extra programming. So uh, 10 or 20 years ago, I had an accident. So many of my original, I lost many of my uh, artworks. Uh, one inch tape was gone. So, but, uh, so after that, uh, uh, U-Magic tape was, this one is, this one is a U-Magic tape. So uh, fortunately, uh, my original RGB data was save, uh, saved, so uh, I was a little bit lucky. So, please, this one. Big damage from COVID-19. So, uh, at that time, I, for example, from Tokyo to Berlin uh, in the airplane, I drove this one gross ideas <laughs> by by hand drawn. <laughs> I had a chance to present at uh, uh, Venice, Venice Biennale uh, in Jap at the Japan Pavilion. So I did many many kind of uh, a, a lot of. Uh, uh, lenticular, 3D lenticular image. Uh, this is a sample of a small one uh, because I did, I brought by hand. So, but at the Venetia Biennale in Japan, in Japan Pavilion, it's a big one and almost two meters meter height, bigger than me. Uh, I present uh, 20 or 30 pieces of different lenticular 3D images. And also uh, stereoscopic, uh, stereoscopic 3D animation. On the theater in, uh, the Jap in Japan, at uh, the Japan Pavilion. Uh, it's uh, 75, uh, 1995, almost uh, uh, 30, 30 years ago. Okay, this one is a very easy I did the more extra test. Can, can you try?
Stop. <laughs> this growth model, model is readily, uh, can react easily for the human action, uh, real timely. And also, uh, we did many uh, hydrodynamic uh, image. Please try. Okay, thanks. Next, please. Um, please, next. My, my interest was uh, 500 million years future. <laughs> if I want to be alive <laughs> in the future. So maybe, for example, my, my idea, <laughs> butterfly has to be evolved. <laughs> so, future butterfly should be like a spaceship for me. <laughs> So uh, this kind of special super uh, butterfly uh, has to be uh, travel with me. <laughs> it's my dream. <laughs> but uh, is, this original idea is, came from a butterfly. Yes. You know, butterflies can fly uh, randomly, and, uh, so still flying, uh, still alive. It's a very, I, I'm very interesting for butterflies' intelligence. Okay, next please. This is a walking butterfly, uh, bottom of ocean. <laughs> uh, bottom of ocean is uh, very dark, so you know, uh, lightning insect, I, mean, I have a good uh, uh, idea from a uh, uh, lightning insect. This can study the lightning uh, uh, rule, so can, they can be, uh, communicate e each other. So future butterflies can walk. How <laughs> so future butterfly have to walk on uh, bottom of the ocean <laughs> or traveling to the, uh, another planet with me. Okay, next. Uh, my gross model has to be evolved like that. Uh, walking seashell. <laughs> I guess this one is uh, may, maybe in a uh, future house for human should be more safe. <laughs> okay, next please. Uh, crab is very interesting for me. <laughs> they are still alive. <laughs> but for I'm thinking of a crab robot, a crab robot. For maybe they are very powerful on the another planet. <laughs> Lot of uh, crab. <laughs> Sometimes a bad, bad guy, bad crowd. <laughs> okay, next please. So uh, lately, uh, we, uh, I'm thinking uh, in near future, our uh, real space uh, combined with uh, digital space. So no, uh, so I try. I, uh, lately, I made uh, many uh, 3D printing uh, growth. So this is a. Uh, idea on, uh, I calculate on uh, 8K pictures. So, um, but, um, but, and also I, I made many tests for, with uh, uh, generative AI. So AI, for AI, generative AI, uh, AI can't understand the programming algorithm. 
But maybe in five years, in 10 years, maybe AI can understand the programming uh, algorithm. I think so. Uh, so anyway, uh, in the future, uh, real space will combine uh, digital space. Uh, a little bit dangerous. <laughs> okay, so today my talk is finished. Thank you very much. Thanks, sir. Thank you. So, thank you, Susanna. <laughs> okay, finished. Thank you very much. <laughs>